David Snyder, best player in the league. He's perfect. He's unreal. Goggles, mustache, dog. Those are fucking uh, fine. Let's see Vladdy playing third. Keep it up, Danny Burgers. He really did what he needed to do, and he locked down the win for the boys. This is Fan First Network. We've got the fucking win right at the end. Let's yeah. fucking... Yeah! yeah! Fucking, I love Babe. He's, yes. he's a dog. He's a fucking dog, the mustache man. He fucking gets it done. He comes in clutch. He's our he's our team. He's our team. The stash gives him power, man. No, he got hit the inning before. Yeah, and uh, I think he had revenge on his mind. Babe fucking Snyder. Yeah, Babe fucking guy. Snyder. I got just two words. Poon, broom. Yeah. Poon, broom. That's the guy right there, that stash man. Oof. It's such a long game. Of course, Babe, of course, Babe was the one to end it too. David Snyder, best player yeah. in the league, baby. Yeah. David fucking Snyder, Snyder baby! Oh. Yo, goggles, mustache, dog. Recipe to success right there. Like, look, I got it too. They were playing catch for a long time. Just playing catch, but you know, came here for bombs, and that's what we got. We got we fucking nukes, baby. You got to see a walk-off. This is Victoria, uh, if any of you guys don't know. Big Jays fan and Leafs fan from Scotland, right? Yeah, that's me. Yep, yep. Hi. Okay. <laughs> so what did you think of the game today? I thought it was amazing. It was long, but it was worth the wait. It was worth the wait. Wow. Amazing game to go to, yeah. Yes. It was long, so we there was... Not a lot of runs at the beginning, but at the end, David Schneider came through. What did you think of David Schneider? Oh, I love David Schneider. Come on, he's the man. He's the man. He's the best. <laughs> the mustache. Everything about him is so cool. He's perfect. He's yeah. unreal. Love him. Worth the four hours. Worth yeah. the four hours. Almost two and ball we're, games, we're, eh? It was. Lots of free baseball. That's right. <laughs> We do We lost this game. We're tearing it down. What? Do you, let's talk about these City okay. Connects. What do you think? So when I first saw the leaks, they were terrible. Right. City Connects, fucking. Those are fucking yeah, fire. Yeah, right? Fire. Fucking fire. fire. They, they look good on camera. Like, you're watching the game on TV, they look good. When you're watching it, like, in the ballpark, they just, they look like they're umps. I was very nervous with Fanatics and all that bullshit, but they, it's so nice. It's so nice. They're so nice. We've been hard on Fanatics, all sports fans, but I got, I got, I can't yeah, lie. This that, is good. That's everything. The whole edition is so clean. They're pretty nice. I don't know. I saw purple in the league, so I was yeah, kind of. I was hoping we get purple. Hoping we get purple. I can't lie. I love them. I'm not going to lie. I bought a hat right here. Let's go, buddy. They, I, we got the same. Yes, we, we picked the same one. Yes, good, good work. Got the alternate, so. Yeah. Great city connects for sure. Like I like bringing back a j black jersey, but it's a little just too dark. Like I understand it's supposed to be dark, but like you can't even see like Toronto from the seats. Oh, they're awesome. Oh, they're the best it. jerseys. Best jerseys in the whole fucking league, baby. They're fine. They're like they're okay. I I'm not buying one, but like I've seen a lot worse. I love the skyline. I love yeah. that, but I'm not sold on buying one unfortunately. They were better than the leak leaked photos, but nothing special. Just it's a classic look. It's gonna be a classic for years to come. <laughs> Nothing to say. It's a great jersey. I can't wait till we're raising the banners with this jersey. Yeah. Raise the fucking pennant, baby. All right, so what did you think of the game? I thought it was fucking sick. David Schneider, man. He came away with the win. I was going to say David Schneider, walk off, first one of the year. Yes. Honestly, we needed that badly. Uh, after so many miserable Rogers Center performances and so many failures at the end of the game with runners on, we finally got one, and it was the babe. The mustachioed man, David Schneider, is great. The mustache is the most powerful thing in the city of Toronto. Danny Jansen, Austin Matthews, David Schneider. The mustache is reign supreme in this city. That's just what it is. What do you think of the, you got the City Connects? Yes. What do you think of that? I thought they're, I think they're pretty good. I'm obviously wearing it, so I bought it. I wanted it to have purple. The Gay 14 podcast, Avery, you got me bought in, buddy. I thought we were getting purple. Instead, we got this. I like it. This is... We haven't had a new jersey since 2012. Like, what are we doing here? Just fucking create jerseys. I'll buy them. I will buy them. I'll buy the hats. We'll all fucking buy them. I'm in on the City Connects. I'm in, bro. We fucking got the win. 5-4. came close. Four. You already know what it is, man. We already beat the Pirates, you know. Done. Series win. Yeah, of course. Can't go wrong with that. I mean, yesterday was a really horrible day, but... We bounce back, though. We come back. If we don't see a Daniel Vogelback statue anywhere, yeah. anywhere in, in, in this in this area at Rogers Center, we're gonna have problems. Cause this man is heating up. I, I don't I don't know what this man was been eating during the morning. Any type of burgers, but it's been working. Keep it up, Danny Burgers. I love it. These people know how to party during a Jays game. Okay, <laughs> so do. it's not just baseball. I mean, I'm a huge baseball fan, but. The atmosphere is what I came for, and the atmosphere turned into a win, baby. It fucking did, man. There were lots of good performances. Danny Vogel back today, bro. Wow. <laughs> wow. I saw Danny Burgers go out there and do his thing. Pretty intense game, you know. Hoping for a little Boba hit, 
Uh, no, a couple of guys took that in their parlays, but it's okay. At the end of the day, you come out for a good game, and that's what we got today. It is, honestly. Bo Bichette hits in the parlay might be a sus thing right now, to be honest. I was a little worried at the end. A yeah. little worried. But they, love to, they love to do that. Fuck, man. I was I was concerned, but they... they Garcia, the closer, he, he killed it. it. He killed it. Good game today, you know, um, starting pitchers, you know, kind of a slow start uh, with Bassett throwing about 80 pitches in four innings. But, um, you know, the offense came together when they needed to, and um, and the bullpen shut it down in the end. So, yeah. It was good. You know, Vogelbach played well. I was hoping for the cycle, but we didn't get to see that. But it was it was really good. It was a really nice game. Uh, get to see Vladdy playing third. Uh, we could definitely move forward with that because Vladdy played really well. I think what they're trying to do here is make, make uh, some space for another player. Um, a DH hitter kind of guy, a power hitter. That makes sense. You get those guys playing DH first base, not third. Yeah. Right. I could see that. Maybe this is the start of the Vladdy at third base experiment. That was his first start at third base since 2019. What did you think? I thought he looked pretty good out there. I think he's much more of a natural first baseman, he is, he is. but um, but for what it's worth, I thought he looked good at third. He should he should he should be a main third baseman. I, he he was not rusty whatsoever. He made those plays look like easy. I love it from Vlad. Hey man, I love I love to have another third base option on the team. Exactly. If you can play him at third, play him at first, and like he, he switch up the games a little, I th I think it would work out. I thought it was good. I thought he honestly played really well positioning wise. He did really good. Um, it was nice to see them switch him back to first towards the end of it, but yeah. he, he held up, he did his own, and you know what, for the chances that the uh, ball made it to him, he did what he did best, you know, so I think it was a good opportunity for him. The guy was a stud out there, he held his ground, he really did what he needed to do, and he locked down the win for the boys. That one snag, I want to say seventh, eighth, yeah. eighth inning, yeah, that was fucking wicked. It was a nice play, honestly, for a guy who's not a third baseman, usually that looked like a third baseman's play. It killed it, killed it. Right, what do you think about David Schneider right now? Good looking guy. Oh, Good looking right. guy, nice mustache, hits home runs, what else do you need from him? Yeah. That's it. Yeah. That's basically the full package. Very clutch player, great addition for the Blue Jays and everything like that. And of course, you know, he always does go when we have runners in scoring position as well. This is Fan First Network. Shout out to Caesars. They shout, out, really shout out Coors Light. You've done me fucking justice here. I mean, I spent a few dollars. Uh, yeah, shout out to Barry, Ontario.